ITR Boxing. You heard it here first. Pretty cool videos. And I heard they're also in HD. ITRboxing.com. No, it's just, it's tough. I'm trying to think what other things we got um, going. We got my man JoJo fighting next month. What do you think of like, uh, I don't know, like who's the pound for pound list for you? Who are the, who are the 10 best fighters in the world? What's the Roshan uh, pound for pound top 10? Pound for pound top 10. You got, it's not going to be in order. No, no, no. We got to do it in order. Okay, in order. So Canelo's one. Canelo's number one. Number two um, is because our official uh, ITR done by Rob Palmer from UK has Terrence Crawford at number eight on our pound for pound list. I'm not sure I agree with that, but it's that's such a hot take that I'm just gonna allow him to do that. Um, I, I it all it, for one. My pound for pound list is gonna determine on how many belts you have, how many unification um, fights you want. So he's high. Yeah, for sure. Um, you got Tyson Fury number two. Crawford probably three. Crawford three. In a way four, or Usyk four. Who? In a way, the Japanese fighter or Usyk, because Usyk unified a whole cruiserweight division. In a way, has won a ton of belts in like three different divisions. But do we count cruiserweight though? Like. That's what I've, I've been saying. Like, cruiserweight's not really a division. Yeah, but you can put him on there because he did He did uni unify. But, like, that's like the division you, like, you only get half credit for fighting at cruiserweight because you probably right. should either be a heavyweight or a light heavyweight. That's why he went up to heavyweight, and that's why I'm saying do we even count that? <laughs> but uh, <laughs> um, Anthony Joshua. Oh, come on, bro. You can't do that. Nah. No. Invalid. Okay, because Fury. I'm I'm just saying, like, there's better fighters. Like Jermel Jermel Charlo is above Anthony Joshua. No. Uh, I mean Lions only. Jermel Charlo is above Anthony Joshua right now. I say, yeah, 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 yeah. It'll be like on some eight, nine type shit. Yeah, like at the very bottom of the list, like where you're just filling out the list and you're picking some names. They're at the bottom of the list. But hell yeah. Golovkin, is he on the list or not? Nah. Mm-mm. He, he 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 lost. <laughs> he's, he's, what's up with like a certain group of people hating on Golovkin, bro? I personally don't care, and it just makes me laugh. But like, I feel like a lot of people just feel like Golovkin was kind of force fed to him. First of all, Gol Triple G. He he hasn't fought nobody since Canelo, and you can't judge nobody he fought. Because they ass and he looked at ass fighting them. So he got some proving to do, bro. I ain't even gonna catch you. He 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 gotta fight some as a name, at least. I mean, Sergey Dervianchenko is a pretty good fighter. I'm not gonna let you say that Sergey Dervianchenko's ass. But he was but the type of fighter Triple G was, he was supposed to get him out of there, man. He wasn't in shape. The in shape triple G would have got him out of there. But this triple G did this. On Charles, a condition. Charles Conwell versus Triple G in two years. Would Charles Conwell move up to 60 to fight Triple G? Oh, uh, yeah. His, he is stopping. He is stopping now. Charles Conwell? You're talking, you said Charles Conwell will stop Triple G right now. He too, he too much of in shape, man. He on another level. He won't out tough him. He'll he, he out thinking. He'll out think Gennady Golovkin? He get tired, bro. Don't if Golovkin turns his back on Charles, I'd be dead. If Charles ran up on Triple G, bro, and Triple G got that tan too that all the girls like. He's like tan, and Charles is gonna not even get a haircut for the fight. Here from now, year and a half in the round fight. 
man, if Charles Fokolovkin, he better get like a like a fade, like a stylized fade or something, bro. They so petty. They, if he fought him, they probably wouldn't even give Charles that much money. Bro, I was looking at Charles. He fought on NBC, and he didn't he didn't even have a stylized haircut. And I was just sitting there with my arms folded. Right. That's that. That's that warrior cut, man. I know, but sometimes you gotta you gotta let that. Some it's like a basketball player. Sometimes you want to be grimy, but sometimes you need to have that fresh cut. Right. He said he about to get the fresh cut next time, though, because you said something. Yeah, because I was on him. Because I, I said good win next time. Cut your hair, because I knew that would just sit and I knew that would sit on him. He'd be like hey, this. Got a haircut. That was his haircut. Shit. He should got. He should have chose a different one. Because his haircut looked, he, he literally looked like an NBA 2K character. I'm just giving him crap, but he looked like a 2K character that went to the haircut store and then, like, just got the regular cut. But I was just messing with him, too, because I don't want Conwell just to get a bunch of praise because I know he's a self-driven person. 